This is the sad story of the rejected smiling critter from Poppy Playtime Chapter 3. No! Why did this smiling critter get rejected? And why is everyone so mean to them? We will find out in this video. And we will even learn new secrets about catnap, including why catnap is not a monster. Oh! No! Are you ready? Let's go! We're learning the sad story of why all the smiling critters from Poppy Playtime Chapter 3 are super sad about the rejected smiling critter. Whoa! Don't hurt us! Don't worry, guys. I can save us. Oh! Maybe. I've had enough of you little pests. You're nothing but an embarrassment to this company. Oh! oh it's catnap! Yeah, guys, it looks like all the smiling critters were scared and backed in a corner by the CEO in the gas mask, but catnap came to save the day! Yeah! I won't let you hurt them! Whoa! Oh, please, you should know by now my mask makes me immune to- Don't worry, I'll find a way to put you to sleep. For good. How do you like this? No! Oh, no. It may not put you to sleep, but it will knock you off your feet. Catnap, be careful! I think he's up to something. Oh! Oops. Oh! Huh? No! You like warm weather? Catnap! No! How could you? <laughs> Hope you like the show, because you're next. Oh, the CEO's so evil, he zapped Catnap and put him into, like, a giant toaster. Catnap might be done for, guys. You think the smiling critters can save Catnap? I hope so. Not on my watch. Blair, what are you doing here? I heard you screaming, and I knew the CEO had to be up to something. Come on. Nice. We're getting out of here. Nice. Tisk tisk. When will they learn? They cannot run from me. Besides... I'd still call this a win. Snap <laughs> 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 oh, is dead. He died. He's gone, and it's all our fault. Okay, so that is why the smiling critters are all super sad because they think Catnap oof. But when Catnap went into that toaster, he might have just found the rejected smiling critter. Let's see and find out. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Calm down. Do you need a hug, or... What are we gonna do without Catnap? I'm really sorry. I know Catnap was kind of an evil monster who tried to kill me a few times, but... I guess everyone's flawed. He was our fearless leader! Hey! I'm supposed to be the fearless leader! Oh, yeah? You weren't very fearless back there! Well, you didn't help either! Guys, we can't fight now! We have to work together! To do what? Get our revenge! He's right, you know. Well, I'll leave you to it. No, we need you. So, we break out of home sweet home, get to the CEO's tower, sneak in, and totally kick his butt. You know it's not that easy, right? We can't even get out of home sweet home. The door requires special handprints. Which player's grab pack has? Baba, you're so smart. An elephant never forgets. Wow, so that is her plan, is to go fight the CEO and kick his booty. Yo! Which, 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 hey, I do that to Adam all the time, and all the plushies do that to Adam plushie all the time. <laughs> all right, Abby, be naughty. Justin, can we go play some low blocks together? No, I never tell you to get your booty kicked. Hey, yeah! Oh. I'll just put my hands here. Okay, great. My work here is done. You can't leave us! Please! Why? Well, if we die, our adorable little blood is on your hands! Yeah! You got yourself into this, and you're gonna get us out! Which? That's not fair! <sighs> Fine, but this better work, and we have to stick to the plan. Kids, huh? Er, toys, possessed by kids. <laughs> to get to the CEO, we'll have to take the train. We can get to the platform through... If it isn't the adorable smiling creatures. It's smiling critters. Tomato, tomato. You brats have some nerve breaking out of your home. We have to save Catnap. Oh, not on my watch. I've had enough of that little monster. Oh. Hey, 
slow me down. I thought her issues were mostly resolved. <laughs> Not when you're siding with the enemy player. Player, don't worry. Guys, let's help. You think some stuffed animals can stop me? <laughs> By now, you should know not to underestimate me. I'll know! We can't fight her! We gotta run! Run! Final stretch! I don't know if we can make it! Ha! Huh, I knew we could! No! Ah! Help me! Help me! I got you! Save him! Save Dog Day! Ooh. Help get you, smiling creatures! Whew. Thanks, everyone! I have a thought! Hey, that's my thing! If we couldn't take down Mommy Longlegs, how are we going to fight the CEO? Who knows what he's got defending him? Maybe we can sneak to the lab and get some kind of weapons? Oh, I want one of those shocky sticks! Or maybe a sword, or a gun! No guns! You're no fun! Eureka! <laughs> Try all you can, smiling critters. But even if you make it to me, I've got my secret weapon. Here, kitty kitty. All right, don't go too crazy. Oh, I'm not finding anything cool. Is this good for anything? Guys, I found something! Whoa! So guys, they went into a laboratory, they snuck in, they found all the different Smiling Critters potions. So guys, these all belong to one Smiling Critter. If they drink these, they might power up and save Catnap. Let's find out what happens when they drink them. We gotta be careful. We don't know what... Whoa! Whoa! I... I... Whee! I can hop! Whoa! I feel... I'm so fast! I got super speed! Here goes nothing! Hmm, I feel... I feel like I know! You know what? Everything! Everything ever! <laughs> including things I should not know! Oh, are you okay? That I do not know! All right, I think we should head to the CEO now. <laughs> I think we're gonna totally kick his butt. The CEO's always got something up his sleeve. I wouldn't get too confident. I'm gonna hop all over him. I just hope we can avenge Catnap and make his death worth something. Done. I must say, that was impressive and entertaining. Wow, guys. So they all powered up. They're here to fight the CEO. Kick his booty. I would kick out his booty. Huh? Wait, why would you do that? <laughs> Ow! <laughs> No, that was you. I that was I you. No, he, was guys, so look, no. Justin made that sound. No, that was you, bro. He tuned him when I cap, cap, I cap, cap, this cap, 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 I cap. This no. no! But your journey ends here. It's over, CEO. There's four of us and only one of you. Ha! Yeah, that's right. Let's get him. Get him. Oh! Catnap, you're alive! I managed to crawl up the furnace walls, and then the CEO captured me. <coughs> <coughs> so, choose your next actions carefully. You can give up and be my prisoners, or die. Can we have a minute to think over our options? Well, I'm sure, I suppose. Okay, guys, listen up. I used my big new brain to come up with a brilliant plan. That was fast. No, player. Being fast is my superpower, silly. Just listen up and try to concentrate. No, the thing is, what we're gonna do is... Would you lot hurry up already? Live or die, it's your choice. I choose neither. What the? No! Save Catnap! Oh, you caught me. Thank you. No problem, buddy. Huh. You're up. Got you. Nice, nice. At me. Don't worry, you're not going to the furnace. Ah, let me go! 
Never mind. Don't let me go. Enjoy the fall. Oh! See ya. And they save Catnap. Oh, I love you. We yeah! Who, Catnap? We'll always be there for you. Always. The Smiling Critters, one of Playtime Co.'s biggest successes. And rightfully so. They were precious. Beloved by children and adults alike. Or at least most of them were. Hmm. Looks like we had a little misprint here. No worries. <laughs> You're going to be with your little messed up friends. <laughs> In you go! The rest? We're doomed to be thrown into the flames. Thankfully, these ones weren't alive. But I know somewhere deep down inside, they could feel the misery of not being perfect. Of being a reject. I know exactly how they feel. Wow, that's the rejected smiling critter from Poppy Played Up Chapter 3. Uh, and their, like, item on them is a broken heart. Why would they have a broken heart? Bro. Wow. The Smiling Critters ruled the world of children's toys. They flew off the shelves, especially Dog Day, their leader, and Bubba Bubba fan as well. With one big exception, Catnap. Playtime Co's newest creation. There were reports that he was giving kids across the country nightmares. I know the path of getting for us. There really was no coming back for a PR disaster like a toy that prevents kids from getting good sleep. With Katna being a total financial failure, the Smiling Critter's brand was almost put on ice. Deciding they had invested too much in the project to give up on it completely, the leaders of Playtime Co. decided to come up with a brand new Smiling Critter. One that went in a new direction. You've seen other cheery smiling critters like Dog Day and Bubba Bubba Fence, but you've never seen anyone quite like Frowny Fox, the brand new smiling critter. Or should I say, unsmiling critter. <laughs> frowny Fox? So it's a smiling critter that's just sad all the time? Yeah, so instead of smiling, it's frowning all the time. This is the rejected origin story of the rejected smiling critter. The newest smiling critter was me. While the others giggle and play, Frowny Fox rests alone, contemplating life's big questions. Unlike the others, he's sensitive, a great listener, and more than anything, longs to be understood. What do you think he's putting in that well? Secrets, Bubba Bubba Fent. Secrets. Frowny Fox, because you can't have rainbows without a little rain. Disclaimer, magical well and cracked mirror not included. They were sure that I would be a valuable new member of the Smiling Critters lineup. A bold innovation that would allow them to tap into a whole array of human emotions. So, what do you think of Frowny Fox, my boy? Pretty cool, huh? He... he's... he's even worse than Catnap! He doesn't have any color! <laughs> and he stinks! He smells like wet dog! Well, technically it's wet fox. To say my feelings were hurt was an understatement. Stop that! He's not yours! Huh? Don't! I'm telling your mother! You failed us, Frowny Fox. Uh, we couldn't be hip with the kids after all. I should have known you were a mistake. Frowny Fox, what an idiotic idea! Like I said, they loved all smiling critters except for the ones they deemed as failures. And now... I was one of them. Oh, that is so sad. So, guys, they made Frowny Fox, but the kids didn't like him, so they got rid of him, and that's why they turned to the rejected smiling critter. But will Frowny Fox make friends after all? Let's see. I don't know how long I sat in the trash, but eventually, a miracle occurred. Someone saved me. Is this a smiling critter? I don't recognize this one. I don't blame them for getting rid of this guy. Maybe I can use him for parts. Whoa! My child, what have they done to you? Don't worry, I can fix you. Catnap, he gave me life. What? I'm alive? Oh, thank you so much. I'll take you home. And that leads us to where we are now. Dog day, Baba, meet our new friend. Hi. What's your name? It's Frowny Fox. Frowny Fox? Really? You all get to know each other. Can I play with you? Nah, we're good. Please. Dog Day, give him a chance. Oh, no. Oh, great. That was
was our last ball. Yeah, thanks for nothing, new guy. Uh, it's okay. Uh, maybe we can still use it. Ah! Ew, severed arm. Get it away from me. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to. What a freak. And he smells too. Oh, that's so sad, guys. Frowny Fox tried to make friends, but everyone else didn't like him. Dog Day Bubba Bubba Fan made fun of him, dude. Man, I feel so bad for the rejected smiling critter. The CEO was right. I belong in the trash. Maybe in the furnace with the others. Don't say things like that. Huh? Uh, who are you? I'm Hoppy. Hoppy Hopscotch. Are you going to be mean to me like the others? Of course not. I've never seen your face around here before. I'm Frowny Fox. I'm a reject. We're all rejects in one way or another, right? No, I was literally rejected by the kids, by the CEO, and now those two. I'm not good enough for anyone. Well, I won't reject you. I personally think you seem like a good guy. You think I'm good? Of course I do. You don't need those other people. I'll be your friend. Really? Yeah! Wow, this is amazing. I've never had food before. That's crazy. Being alive for the first time? I hardly remember. It feels so long ago. Hoppy, what are you doing hanging out with that freak? Snack time, huh? I've got a snack for you. Ah, Hoppy, help. Get out of here, loser. Oh, man. So, Frowny Fox finally made a friend with Hoppy Hopscotch, but here comes Mean Dog Day, and now he used him as a shield, so he got hit with the cupcake, so he probably thinks Hoppy Hopscotch thinks he's a loser. Now, wait a minute, Justin. Are the smiling critters being meanies? The Important announcement, everybody. Give me my hat right now. This guys, everyone right listen right up. If you guys are watching on an iPad or a TV or anything, turn the volume up. Justin is about to speak the truth. Everyone listen to what Justin's about to I'm say. I'm gonna say this twice, because it's so important. Mm. Meanies are weenies. A little bit louder for the people in the back. Meanies are weenies. <laughs> okay, so everyone knows. You had to say it like that. I did, I did, I did. <laughs> really? You too? Freddy Fox, no. It was an accident. I didn't mean to hit you. I knew you'd be just like them. I'm leaving forever. Freddy Fox, wait. The lab I was made in. It must be this way. Oh, I can't fit in here, but maybe I can fit part of me. Now all I have to do is find the right ingredients. This will show them all. Here goes everything. <laughs> they have no idea what's going to hit them. Uh-oh. Well, 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 if it isn't the freak show, I'm surprised you came back after all. You're gonna regret what you did, Bubba. What are you gonna do? Smack me to death with your broken arm? Good luck with that. What the? Whoa, so Catnap stuck into a, la a laboratory and made a potion that gave him like Catnap's ability. Now he's getting revenge, but that's not nice either. That makes him a meanie. Don't worry, I won't kill you. At least, I don't think so. <laughs> <laughs> you again. I figured you went back to the furnace with the other freaks. That's where you belong. Ah! What the? Let me go. Let me go. And why should I? Get ready to take a long nap, dog day. Wait. Hoppy, what do you want? I want you to let dog day go. Why should I? Because this isn't the real you. Don't you remember? We had so much fun together. We were friends. You're not mean. They made you this way. You're a good critter. But just because they hurt you doesn't mean you should hurt them. You're right. Dog Day, you're a jerk, but I'm not going to hurt you. Wh whatever. I'm out of here. You did the right thing. What have you done? I rescue you, and this is how you repay us. Kidnap, no! He's changed! I know he's changed. Into a monster! No! I saw what you did to Bubba. You nearly killed him. I promise not to hurt anyone else, Catnap. Please! Why should I believe you? No! 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 
that ought to show you. I gave you a chance at life, and you abused it. I better not see you here again. No! Brownie Fox, I... Leave him be. He doesn't deserve your help. Hoppy, why are you helping me after everything I've done? Just because you made a bad choice doesn't mean you're all bad, Brownie Fox. You'll never be a reject to me. Yeah, that's a happy ending! Cool!